This video is rated TVMA because I cuss and there's scant nudity and there's gore everywhere and violence and me beating on things and, you know, me saying sexual innuendos and double entendres and stuff. It's just not for kids, okay? Just don't have your kids in front of this one because there's a whole bunch of non-kid friendly stuff in the video. HouseofGeek.net has a new, clean, crisp look. It's easy to navigate, you can get to the featured stuff a lot easier, and you can scroll down to see all the many ways that you can support me. From buying my novels, to hiring me as a freelancer to work for you, and to even click on how to support me through Patreon and Ko-fi. Yes, that's right, click the link in the description today and find out all the many ways that you can support your creator. And while you're there, don't forget to follow the blog.
Hello, my lovable misfits. We're being really quiet this morning because I have one hell of a headache. I got a scraped knee. And I'm infarcted. And I'm surrounded by hookers and zombies with eye problems. Waiting till 4 o'clock to hop down to make it home to see what kind of medical supplies I got there. And yeah, we only have 34 hit points. We had more, but I had to take a vitamin and scarf down two pimento cheese sandwiches. And you know, they knock you for five health a pop. So we're going to see how far this day is going. I have to concentrate on finishing the horde base so I don't have to get out of for tomorrow. We got to turn in a quest and see if that can anchor us faster than the horde. But first, I have to concentrate on getting myself out of the predicament because I said I wanted to spawn on my bed, and my bed is here. So I wound up back at the pass and get first idea for a horde, for a crafting. Yeah, that happened. Up, oh, everything's getting lighter. Still hearing tippy taps and toes and everywhere. Oh, good. Oh, let's pop down and get the hell out. All right, let's get in here and get some antibiotics. Uh, oh, honey! N nope, nope, nope. I forgot I had the herbals. I need one of those. And I hear him walking around outside. Open the door, run right by him. Oh, he found me. Now I'm gonna have to move. That's the problem with stalkers. Once they find your address, they never leave you alone. Oh, he bled out and brought me a prezi. Still doesn't change anything. You're annoying. Nobody likes a stalker. Get a hobby. Okay, I gotta empty all this crap out. I got a ton of stuff to sort out. Let's see what we can do here. Put some of all. I know I need a better sorting system. That'll happen after the hoard. I gotta get this base going. I also gotta go to Rex. That'll be fun. Hmm. Put this over here. I gotta go in the bathroom and sort out all that stuff. Um, let me see. Oh my bathroom's this way, stupid. Okay, uh line this up over here that way I can see stuff at a glance and yep okay time for Rex all right let's see what this cantankerous bastard has for rewards oh right gotta do this I left some shit in here let's overburden myself again shall we wait hang on let me sort this do I really need all this shit yeah I guess so Empty it out, take it with me, put it up when I get home, and then sort out my shit later. Alright, okay, Rack, you bastard. Here we go. At least wipe that smirk off your face. I'm not smirking. Mm -hmm. You don't give me an option. Ooh, cobblestone. That'd be good. Alright, where are we going? Mm -hmm. What's this? I've got work. If. You don't uh, mind. You, nobody tells me nothing is not important. What is important is if you okay, don't just. Okay, we'll do that one. Here. Not right now, but we'll do that one. All right, now we get to go back home. You ever get the feeling you have too much shit? I'm getting that feeling right about now. I know I can break down the chairs. Don't feel like it right now. I got other priorities. Oh, let's see. Sales box. A little more cash to sell. Not too bad. Oh, shit. I'm going to need a water filter. You know, where I put the nails? Nope. Can't put the nails there. Definitely can't put the nails 
What there? Oh shit, I hit the wrong button. I gotta put that mod in. Hey, fun pimp. Mod, please. Like, come on, lockable slots. It's not that hard. Jeez. Alright, by the next episode, I should have lockable slots. Because this is mad. Every time you forget, boom, you gotta resort everything. Alright, of course, you know, it could be me, because I'm not paying attention to squat. Alright, let's come over here. Open up the fridge for more bacon and eggs. And how you turn, like, deer and chickens and, you know, ninja bunnies into bacon and eggs. I don't know. The magic of the fun pimp's kitchen, I guess. Alright, so we got those cooking. While those are cooking, I'm gonna take a look at these things. I did allocate a point. Can't remember where I put it. So we're going to allocate this point. Hmm. I don't know where the hell do I want to put it. I think I want to put it pistols, maybe? I know I need pistols eventually. I don't have any points in archery. Shit. Okay. Maybe there. Light armor would help. Mm, uh, archery. Okay. I can't hit the broad side of a barn with this primitive thing, but, you know, archery. Because that makes perfect sense. Alright, I'm going to finish up here and then meet you guys at the base. Alright, here we go. As you can see, I got a lot of work to do. I got to reinforce the legs. I got to put a roof. <laughs> That's going to be fun. Alright, so let's get to it, shall we?
All right, I hope you guys are still with me after all that. Sorry I got carried away in the moment and decided to do a whole hell of a lot of shit. Of course, today is the day before a horde night, so the more I do now leaves me less tonight in the overnight to do. So now, this leaves the question of how do I entertain you until I come back here to do some night work? I could roam around aimlessly. Hmm. It'd be good to scout out some random POIs to see if we can do some, you know, unscheduled shopping. Because after all, here in the zombie apocalypse, we don't loot, we don't steal. We simply appropriate unused goods in order to put them to their best use. Oop, the unfinished boulder. Let me go ahead and get rid of this. Um, okay. Yep, so that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be wandering around, probably collecting things and seeing how much stuff we can gather before we got to come back here and work on the base. Because I really do want to have it done before the horde gets here. Oh, chicken! Okay, and, you know, I don't like last minute running around trying to get the stuff fixed. And I got it mostly done anyway, so... I'm gonna come over here. I just gotta make sure I have enough wood. I gotta do the cobblestone thing, obviously. So, oh, right, we need those. Goo piles are always good. Love me a good goo pile or three. In this case, probably three, maybe four. Don't ever remember how many are in this little POI thing. You can always use glue. I'm kind of like Cap, if you're wondering. I There's nothing I throw away, hardly. I mean, if I look like I'm going to be overburdened, in other words, more shit I find than I can carry, then I'll put a box and mark it on the map come back later. Because you never know what you're going to need in this game, and you never know what you're going to run out of. Hopefully with me, I don't run out of anything, because I always, as you see, chase shinies. Or in this case, trash bags on the side of the road. Who knew? Oh, let's see here. Some more trash. Oh, a seed. Okay, whatever. Whatever. Come in. Ooh, wait a minute. Are those nests? Oh, I passed the nests. Oh, wait, what the hell? Yes, this is a voiceover in case you're wondering. My recording through OBS and my first foray into like noise gating didn't work out so well. I wound up cutting myself off and fading out. So we're doing a voiceover. Oh, okay. A book. Fear Hunter. Okay, got that. Let's see. I'm looking around. What the hell am I doing here? Oh, okay. Don't stop, sweetheart. Just walk around. Okay. Yeah, I heckle myself. You guys know this. I heckle myself in editing. Why not on a voiceover? Okay, so wiring, okay, I'm a, oh, whatever that was, I was to get an electrical traps, probably a tech junkie, that's my guess. And who do we have over, Karen, are you okay? You don't look like you're okay. Oh, what's in here? Ooh, it's an entrance to the POI, oh, it's a three skull POI, well, I don't know, I'm in a three skull POI. I don't know why I'm scared of them. As long as you're careful, you can make your way through. Well, I don't know this POI, so yeah, not going in it. Maybe later when I'm a little more armed and feeling more adventure. Okay, who's growling at me? Oh, hi, Bo. Hi, yourself. There. St oh, I missed your nuts. Oh, honey, you don't have to lose your head over me. I ain't all that in a bag of chips. I mean, you know, some people will say I'm cute, I have a good personality, I'm very sarcastic, and it's sometimes funny, but, you know, I ain't all that in a bag of chips. Ooh, Karen right in the face. One shot. Okay. Mm. That looked like that hurt. What's what's in here? Yeah, this Super Shamway? No, not going in there. No, honey, I'm not crazy. Or stupid. Though I do tend to make some stupid decisions sometimes. Ooh, chicken. Ha <laughs> more meat. All right, let's see. Come on over here. No, okay, apparently I'm... Oop, okay, what's in the car? And... Kabip. Oop, okay, more stuff. Stuff and things, as people say. Oop, okay, more bones and rotten meat for the card. Who left the 
just laying around. One ear of corn. I guess they figured they didn't hide. You have got to be the loudest zombie in the apocalypse. Sweetheart, it ain't that serious. You ain't got to yell at folks. Oop. Okay, archery volume two. Ooh, exploding arrows and bolts. That looks like fun. And, oh, okay, another medical journal. Okay. Didn't learn anything. Okay. Much like stupid people. You read stuff, don't learn nothing. Okay. Uh, ooh, that's nice. It had a facelift. It's looking good. Okay. It needed a facelift. I and, mean, you know, a lot of these POIs are looking a lot better than they used to. Which is good. I mean, you give him a facelift and now you got new stuff to contend with. So a POI that you fondly remember is now, where the hell do I go? Hmm. All right, let's see. Oh, I said, I hear somebody growling. Oh, there's my stalker. Hi. <sighs> I'm telling you, once they know where you live, they never leave you alone. Oh, this darn headache. Son of a bitch. Yourself, sweetheart. You ever think maybe if you articulated, you'd get a girlfriend? I mean, not me, but, you know. Maybe Arlene. Ow! The fuck happened? Or Karen over here. That likes to sneak up on people and smack people. Look, I just got over an infection, baby. No touchy. Right in the cooch. Serves you right. Got a jagged bone up to cooch. Matter of fact, that sounds a little painful. Never mind. <laughs> All right, let's see. Wandering. Oh, hi, Arlene. How you doing? Oh, there's a stalker I could introduce you to. I'm sure he would love to wander around with you, but I don't. Right, come on, one more. Oh shit, out of there. Come on, come on, come on. Back up, back up. Oh, she bled out. Good for me. That's empty. Oop, got another point. Wandering around trash bag. All right. Oop, barbed wire mod. I can, well, I don't know. I'm not doing bat, so I can't make a Negan. I know the bat's name is Lucille, but Negan is the one that put her together. That's why I call it a Negan. Okay, books. What do we got? Oh, we got bacon and eggs first, because we're bitching about being hungry. Um, take a little water. A little water. Look what we got. Um, oh yeah, that 25% thing. Alright, more damage to stuff and less damage to people. Got it. Okay, one of those, one of those. Ooh, we learned something. Ooh, hallelujah. We, okay, mm-hmm, we learned something. I'll figure that out later. All right. Um, apparently, I'm trying to figure out where the hell to go. Sweetie, it ain't, it ain't that cereal. Okay. Where are we going to put this point? Where did I decide to put the point? Oh, boy. Let's see. Um, shoot, honey, hurry up. It takes you forever to make a decision. Ooh, okay. Agility. That works. And pistols. I'm glad you and I agree. You know, if you look at it a certain way, I'm not running around aimlessly picking up garbage. I'm beautifying the neighborhood. I mean, who wants all those piles of garbage lying around anyway? Ooh. Yep. What's in here? Da -da -da -da. Ooh, a first aid kit. Nice. I think that's my first one. Cool. Something else for the medicine cabinet. Okay, let me see. I'm trying to figure out what the hell I'm doing. I'm looking at the top. Oh, hi, Tom. Excusez-moi, monsieur. You was in my way. No, 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 no. I hear a tubby. Oh, you brought the tubby. I'm contemplating my future. Hell, oh, you're gonna. Sh yep, you're trying to shoot the tubby. I swear to God, this game. I know I'm hitting him, and some of these right through. All right, all right, all right, Tubbo. 
Mr. I like the phase and I cannot lie. All right, no, no, oop. oh no, 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 sir. Wall that fat in my direction. Disgusting. You know, he reminds me of that guy in Monty Python. Yeah, you know, I don't know if it's the Monty Python skit. That guy that always ate and threw up and then he threw up when he was giving a mint. That, don't remember his name. All I know is every time I watch that skit, it makes me sick to my stomach. I don't know why. It just grosses me out. Um, of course, I hope I am fully described that particular skit because if not, there's a bunch of people watching this video that have no idea what I just talked about. Oh boy, well, okay, going back home. All right, here we go. Sometimes me and my hoarding capacity. Hi, I'm Maddie. The last time I hoarded something was like 10 minutes ago. Hi, Maddie. Okay, let's see. Oh boy, it's hard to figure out where to put everything when you don't have stuff labeled to sort it into. All right, what are we gonna do? Right, it's getting that time of the day. Let me get some more stuff done on this base. Oop, okay, boulders. Okay, I'm just realizing that I have drank the last of my water. All right, let's see here. We're gonna go home and figure out what we got here. I knew I should have bought that stupid water filter. Maybe we can get to Rex in time to buy the water filter and set up a dew collector. Let me see what we've got in here first. Oh, we've got, oh, one, one water. Ah, 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 okay, um, okay. Put that in there. Oh, wait, okay. oh got just enough fuel. Oh, look, two, two murky waters. Ah, 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 okay. No, all right. Yep, all right, we got all of our bacon and eggs. We're gonna have to collect some more of that tomorrow. Now I'm gonna, where am I gonna do this? Oh, right, I'm gonna figure out, right, because we gotta make some shit on the way there so we can get up some cobblestone when we get back. Multitasking. All right, I'm gonna go um, to that. Okay, why are you going back upstairs? All right, you're thinking about that. Okay, I am thinking about walling that one where I have the door, just making it a wall, making it a single car garage. I think that's what I'm gonna wind up doing. Ooh, this is when I discover that I have even more clay and one little stone hanging out all by its lonesome. Hmm, oh well. Now let's see, are we done? We're done with one water. So now we have two, two waters. Ah, 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 okay. Um, do I go back for that third one? I don't know. Dew collector. I'm tracking it. All right. So now I got to go and collect stuff for the dew collector and then hope I have enough time to go back to Rex. All right. Let's get this water filter from the king of the well, dickheads. I'll sell you goods, but if you cross me, you'll meet the wrong end of my 44. I'm sure I will. And then you'll have nobody to do your work for you. Just keep that in mind, dumbass. Oop, okay, there's my water filter. All right, we have one water filter. And I buy some more water to tie this over. Hopefully, so we do click. I'm planning on having about three. Three should be enough for one person. For glue and all that stuff. Because so it's nine a day if you get them going. Okay, yeah. Let's see here. What the hell are you doing? Stu oh, right. Crafting the Duke Collector. Okay. Now we're going back home. Okay. Now, where am I going to put this Duke Collector? I know it's going to be on the side of the house until I can put an elevated platform out. So I'd rather have them elevated so they won't get pounded on. That's just a little bit of paranoia. Because, you know, these stupid zombies will pound on anything. And the last thing I need is one less dew collector. Or in this case, being back down to none, seeing how I only have one. I do have to get two more. And I will get two more. 
All right, so, oh, we have a horse, maybe? Oh, I don't know. Oh, uh, there's a Kenny there. Hi, Kenny. How you doing? Ooh, got you in the hip. I don't know how that works, honey. My hips have been bugging me for years. Ooh. Oh, man, that was Oh, another Prezi from the Stalker. Still doesn't change anything, bud. Get yourself a girlfriend and a hobby other than following me around. All right, let's see. I'm taking, I guess she's surveying the area. I don't remember what I was doing here. Oop, stone. Oh, I didn't, didn't finish pounding on it. Okay, let's go ahead and get the rest of the rocks out of this boulder. All right. I know on my journey over here, I didn't see any large boulders for me to stand on top of, so I don't know what's going on with that. Haven't seen very many of them, or I haven't noticed very many of them. Sometimes my perception is shit. Just like my memory is of late. When you get older, stuff starts going wonky on you. Get, well, me, it's chemo brain and ADD. And then, you know, your hips. I abused my ankles and knees as a kid, so, you know, that didn't help. When we were kids, we think we're invincible. And then when we get older, we pay for it. <laughs> Jeez, ain't that the way? Do you think you're invincible and you're going to live forever when you're a kid? And you get older and you wake up and you can do a real good impression of Rice Krispies when you pour the milk in the bowl. All right, so this is where I'm going to leave you guys. So may you never thirst, may your bellies never rumble, and always keep a lookout for Screamers. See you next time. I'd like to take this time to thank you, the viewer, and my supporters whose names are on the screen for watching this video. If you liked it, there's a like button down there, and don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell so you can get notified every time there's an upload. There's also a video down below here in the bottom left-hand corner as a suggestion, as well as a couple of places that you can click to subscribe. As I always say, behave, my lovable misfits, and if you can't behave, at least be good at it.